Welcome back guys. Today I'm showing you what I got myself for Christmas. Sorry my voice is still a little messed up, but it is getting better. We'll start over here with the big item first. I was not going to get myself a mixer. I said that if I could find it for under $200 that I would pick it up for myself. This one was $161.77 out the door today, the 21st of December at Meyer. So I picked it up and it was a huge pain in the butt because as you can see over here the barcodes are messed up and I just I did the shop and scan but when I got to the cash register they needed to scan three items and all I had was three items and this wouldn't scan so and then they went to look and the lady couldn't find it on the shelf and then they typed it in as a do-it-yourself item and the coupons didn't come off so I ended up going back there and taking the shelf tag off the shelf and bring it up there and they scanned that in order for me to be able to buy this for the price that it was on sale for. So I am getting a kitchen mixer. I have no idea what I'm going to do with it. I've never had a stand mixer. I do have a Roboku and I really don't use that for much either. So let me show you what else I got myself. I got myself this <clears throat> The Price is Right Blinko game. I just thought it would be fun to play and I've wanted it for a couple years. And it was $14.54 on sale with Santa Bucks and all that from Meyer. I also got myself a spoon rest. I don't have one of these so I just went ahead and picked up one. It was $3.20. I got some new whisks. Because it seems like every time I need a whisk, they're dirty. As four dollars and twenty-seven cents. I really want. I really like the Nintendo games and the Nintendo Switch, but I'm not paying three hundred dollars for a Nintendo Switch. So I bought myself this little game. It has built-in classic games, and it was only twenty-six dollars and fifty-three cents. My grandparents had one of these when I was growing up—a little poker game—and I always enjoyed playing it when I was a kid. So I got myself another one for me to have and this was $13.16 and the last two things I got the unofficial Disney Parks cookbook I thought this could be fun doesn't really have a whole lot of pictures but I thought it would could be fun to do with my kids and we did get some like Disney cookie cutters not that long ago as well this was $15.94 and the last thing I got myself was this, um, the best of secret restaurant recipes. This was $6.99 plus tax at Aldi, so $7.41 would have been what this cost. And I just thought it would be fun to try to make some of these, some of these recipes at home because we don't really go out to eat because it's very, very expensive to go out to eat. So I thought we could try to make some of these different recipes at home and see how they are. And that's everything I got myself for Christmas this year. If you like this video, give it a big thumbs up. Hit the subscribe button down below to subscribe to my channel. Hit the bell notification when I, to get notifications when I post new videos. And until next time, we'll be seeing you. Bye guys!